Tonight, the NAACP Houston branch is presenting their Freedom Forward Legends Award to iconic Houstonians who have contributed to the progress of our community. Coco Dominguez is joining us tonight. And Coco, you have gotten a chance to catch up with a couple of the honorees ahead of the big event. Yes, I did. And we are so thankful for their efforts to all those Houstonians who are really making this city such a better place to be in, including Pastor Rudy and Juanita Rasmus with the Bread of Life. It's been a beautiful journey and to, and to have our, our friends and colleagues say well done uh, while we're still here to, uh, to hear it. Uh, it's, it's a beautiful thing. Pastors Rudy and Juanita Rasmus founded St. John's Church more than 30 years ago and have spent the last three decades serving the most challenged demographics in the Houston area. They've been blessed with different grants and partnerships, including that of Houston's own Beyonce's Be Good Foundation. Beyonce grew up here at St. John's. Uh, she has always been a, uh, an amazing supporter of the work uh, that we've done here at the Bread of Life and, and St. John's. The funding Be Good provided to the Bread of Life Inc. Houston created a platform for the distribution of 3.9 million pounds of food and $4 million in supplies annually. They assist more than 8,000 individuals on a monthly basis. Be Good will continue to help small businesses and is incorporating that into Beyonce's upcoming tour. She is uh, actually launching what's called a Black Parade across seven uh, U.S. cities uh, during the tour. And in each city, uh, the goal is to, to highlight entrepreneurship uh, and empowerment. She's uh, donated uh, in excess of a um, of million dollars. The Bread of Life also wants to make sure they tackle mental illness. Pastor Juanita Rasmus recently released her memoir, Learning to Be. It's, it's capturing my experience of having had a major depressive episode. My hope is that as an advocate for mental health and awareness, that people will find this as a resource. Learn to be. That's Learning it. Learning to be. That's it. And Miss Tina Knowles wrote the foreword. She on sure, sure this. did. Yes, I'm grateful for that. We actually have known Tina from uh, the early '80s, mm -hmm. and from that you know moment forward, uh, of course, we've been connected at the hip. There are at least uh, two buildings on our campus uh, that bear the Knowles name. Uh, one housing development, and uh, there's a new as a building that they built as a gym. Uh, uh, Kelly Rowland and and Beyonce. Uh, and Tina built uh, back in 1999 that's getting ready to become the Nose Rolling House. Uh, 31 units of housing for younger adults who have uh, aged out of foster care. Wow, so much beautiful work is being done over at St. John's. Can you believe that? I mean, they are helping every part, every everyone they can get their hands on. Now, if you need help or you would like to help, I will put a link in my Instagram bio so you can click right to it and just really be a part of the change here. In it's Houston. amazing to see the humbled star power that makes such a difference in it, our community. It completely makes a difference. We're so thankful. For All right, it. Coco, thank you.